so hello guys in this video i will show you how you can fix the react memory leak error that we face when we try to update state on an unmounted component so here as you can see i have a two component component a and b so if i will uh, change the state to component b now it won't be logging the errors because the state is already set but if i will so as you can see the error has been logged because the because we are trying to uh, set state on component A which is already unmounted so let me quickly show you guys the code so first of all we have the uh, in our app.js we have the toggle buttons and then I'm conditionally conditionally rendering the component A and B so in component A I'm uh, using the user effect for fetching the user list and then rendering it uh, nothing fancy over here and just a state to maintain the data that we are uh, getting in response from the API and component B is just a, a dummy component just to uh, you know just to do the mounting and mounting of the components uh, so yeah let me quickly show you guys how we can uh, fix the error so in our component A I will use the so first method is will be using the user app and we will be uh, is using a is mounted ref which will be by default which is going to be true okay so basic approach is that like uh, we will keep track of the component when it get unmounted so that we can know that yeah un component is already unmounted we don't need to set data to the component I will so in the cleanup of the use effect I will be what I will be doing is I will be just setting the is mounted dot current cause it's a ref current to false okay so in this way we can keep track of the component whether it's mounted or not okay and bef just before setting the uh, state what I will do is I will just perform a check if is mounted dot current is true if it's true then only we will be setting the state okay and if you will see so yep now no matter how quickly I change my state it was working fine and yep and so I also wanted to show you guys another method so which is um, without using the use ref we will just maintain a is mounted flag equals to true okay it's ju it, it's just a flag no ref and nothing so it will be let and then we will be setting it on in the cleanup we will be setting it to false and before setting data we will just check if it's true or false and yep this also will fix our issue so uh, yep so our issue has been fixed and yep that's it in this video i hope you guys have got how to resolve the issue and use it in our in your own project and in your own page thank you so much for watching guys see you guys in the next video